I was gonna say, I wonder how much he was getting paid to be out there in the snow. Apparently not enough because he turned back home. Yeah, he said, I'm out. Right. Like, I, you know, you I'm guys, you gotta, guys, yeah. you gotta raise the rate. Now, unfortunately, some of that snow is still out here this morning. We're not out of the woods just yet, but it's going to be quickly wrapping up probably in the next couple of hours or so. Then we'll start to even see maybe a little bit of sunshine break through the clouds this afternoon. But before we talk about what's going to be happening later this afternoon and into the weekend. We're still dealing with our winter storm warning across parts of the Lehigh Valley and into the Poconos. Berks and Lehigh County will see this expire in the next 45 minutes, right around 7 o'clock or so in the morning. Now, if you're in Northampton, Carbon and Monroe counties, this winter storm warning is still expected to go until 9 o'clock in the morning because, again, we're still tracking the chance for some frozen precipitation. So this is our morning mix across much of South Jersey. If you are still seeing a little bit of precip, it's staying as all rain. Temperatures are well up into the 30s, even close to 40s uh, right along the shore. Now in the Philly and the surrounding suburbs, it's generally rain. But if you're traveling again north and west of the city, we're seeing that sleet and snow and even freezing rain mix. We've seen Trang out there in some of the elements this morning. It's definitely not an easy go on those roadways, especially the side streets. And then for the Lehigh Valley and the Poconos, we're mainly snow for the next couple of hours, but a little bit of sleet could mix in towards the tail end of this uh, precip because again, it could get just a little bit warm enough, but overall it looks like if you're up across I-78 and northward, this is a completely snow event for us here this morning. Storm scan three shows the low itself kind of spiraling across the Long Island. It's going to track off to the north and east, and then it's wrapping in that colder air, but it quickly diminishes the precipitation does once the low gets far enough away. So 46 degrees, we go with those clearing skies later this afternoon. As I said, as most of this rain kind of slow slush, snow slushy mix wraps up here this morning, 48 on Saturday. It's still cold on Sunday and unfortunately no rest for the weary Chandler even towards the holiday as we don't escape the 40s all next week.